Hello, everyone. My name is Rui Yun Xu. I'm a senior research assistant at the University of Hong Kong. The study I'm going to present is Social Link, Leveraging Relation Information for Venture Recommendations in Two-Sided Matching. It is a joint work with Dr. Hai Liangchen from Hong Kong U and Professor J. Leong Zhao from CU Education Zhen. The phenomenon that we examine is venture capital investment. Venture capital refers to the investment of funds by venture capitalists in founding or early growth of new companies in exchange for equity stake. Venture capital has been growing rapidly over the past few decades in the US. According to the CB Insights, the US VC founding reached a historical high in 2018. The total amount of VC founding is up to $118.7 billion. According to a survey with global VCs, selecting the right investments is considered to be the most important step in value creation. However, VCs often face great challenges in investment selection. First, information symmetry between investors and investees is higher in venture capital than in public stock markets. Different from public firms, private firms are not required by financial regulations to disclose information on operation and performance. VCs often need to rely on private information, which is hard to collect, to evaluate the quality of startup companies. Therefore, they often face great uncertainty in the evaluation process. Second, VCs also face substantial uncertainty arising from two-sided matching between them and the startups. An investment deal can only be established when the VC making an offer and the startup accepting it at the same time. There are chances that a startup may turn down the offer from the VC, especially when facing with multiple offers. Startup recommendation models, which can significantly facilitate investment selection, have attracted increasing attention in both academia and industry in recent years. A recent article in the CIO journal column of Wall Street Journal reports that VC firms are now applying artificial intelligence algorithms to help with their own investment decisions. Different models have been developed, which are categorized as item K nearest neighbor, matrix factorization, and feature based model. Item based K nearest neighbor and matrix factorization utilize historical investment deals to infer investors' preferences, while feature based model utilizes information on past funding runs and company demographics and aims to learn pattern on decision making from historical data. However, Existing models can be less effective in real practice for star recommendation because these models have not considered the exchange of private information between VCs and startups and mainly focus on one-sided preferences of investors. In other words, existing models cannot alleviate the, information, uh, the high uncertainty due to information symmetry and two-sided matching. Significant research gaps exist in the current state of research in this area. So in this study, we're filling the research gap and propose a novel startup recommendation framework by leveraging complex relation information. We designed a model based on theories from sociology and empirical evidence in management and finance. We review prior literature and summarize the findings related with proximity principle in management and finance. We find that first, personal and organizational relationships are important sources for VCs to collect private information and thus can alleviate, alleviate the information symmetry between VCs and startups. Second, Relational connections not only can increase the level of trust between VCs and startups, but also are indicative of the extent of matching in terms of social norms, culture, and expertise. Therefore, we hypothesize that relations can provide valuable information that cannot be otherwise reflected from information on the company demographics and past funding runs, and that 
Leveraging such additional information can significantly improve the startup recommendation performance. We also summarize the types of relations which are shown to have significant influence on investment decisions. In total, five different types of relations are identified, including prior employment affiliation, education connection, ethnic connection, geographic proximity, and industry relatedness. To integrate these different types of relations and utilize such complex relation information for startup recommendation, we adopt the technology of knowledge graph. Guided by the theory, we first built a venture capital knowledge graph to describe various relations between venture capitalists and the startups. We include major parties participating in venture capital investment activities, namely venture capitalist, startup, and the person. We also include entities such as industry, location, ethnicity, educational institution to represent certain characteristics. The constructed graph is able to depict different connectivity patterns between VCs and startups examined in prior management and finance studies. For example, the graph shows whether a VC and a startup locate in the same city, whether two organizations operate in the same industry, or whether any employees of two organizations graduated from the same educational institution. This figure shows our proposed framework, which is referred to as relation-based recommendation framework. The framework consists of four components, including graph construction, heterogeneous graph analysis and recommendation, machine learning and feature analysis, and the system prototype and the graph visualization. First, we merge the data collected from Crunchbase and Origins Infer to construct a venture capital knowledge graph. Then we adopt two different approaches to model multi-relational data for startup recommendation. The first one is graph embedding approach. Graph embedding approach encodes entities and relations in the graph into low dimensional embeddings. Based on entity and relation embeddings, we can compute dissimilarity scores. Recommendations are made based on the dissimilarity scores. The second one is the meta pass based approach. In a meta pass based approach, we first define a set of meta paths based on theories and then fit the meta pass based measures into gradient boosting decision trees. We also develop a hybrid model to integrate the new relation based features with company demographics and past funding runs. Next, we evaluate the performance of the proposed framework by conducting computational experiments using real-world datasets. We also conduct feature analysis to uncover the relative importance of different relation-based features. Finally, we develop a web-based prototype that contains both recommendation and graph visualization modules. In the, in the following sections, I would like to discuss the computational experiments we conduct to evaluate the performance of the proposed methods. We include all existing style recommendation models as benchmarks. The methods include random, recommend, uh, random recommendation, item-based k-nearest neighbor, matrix factorization, and feature-based model. In the feature-based model, we, we include 32 features adapted from prior studies. This figure shows the comparisons among different models in terms of average F1 score at the top N recommendations. The X axis shows the value of N, which is said to be 1, 5, 10, 15, and 20. From bottom to top, different lines represent different methods. As we can see that relations and plus Relations plus baseline features model achieves the best performance. The meta pass based approach using only seven meta pass based features outperforms all benchmark methods. The results support our proposition that startup recommendation model using relation information can achieve superior, superior performance. We also conduct a feature importance analysis to uncover the relative importance of different relations. 
The X axis is the value of feature importance defined by Guinea impurity in the gradient boosting decision trees. The Y axis is the feature names. The most important feature is the dissimilarity score in chance D. This feature is computed based on both entity and relation embeddings, which contain information of connectivity patterns across heterogeneous relations. The dominant feature importance of dissimilarity score validates our proposition that synthesizing multiple kinds of relations is instrumental in predicting the business partnerships between VCs and startups. We also develop a prototype for star recommendation to demonstrate the utility of the proposed framework. The prototype includes both recommendation and visualization modules. In a recommendation module, we return top end startups for any VC specified by users. In the visualization modules, we first display a knowledge graph centered on selected entity. We also show all, all metapathies between every pair of VC and startup. The purpose is to allow users to better understand the recommendation results. The contributions of our study include, first, we propose a novel framework that considers complex relation information for making startup recommendations. Our study is one of the first to demonstrate the value of knowledge graph in financial services in the emerging AI and fintech areas. Third, the social link prototype demonstrates the successful implementation of our proposed framework for real world large scale star recommendation. That's all about my presentation. Thank you for your attention. We welcome comments and suggestions.